फास्टेस्ट क्रिकेट स्कोर अपडेट्स या सबसे डिटेल स्टैट्स क्रिकेट के अंदर बाहर की खबरें या हेल्दी डिबेट्स सबसे एक्यूरेट एनालिसिस या फैंस का क्रेज सबके लिए एक ही प्लेटफॉर्म क्योंकि क्रिकेट मतलब क्रिकेट नेक्स्ट Hello everyone you're watching cricket next time so I'm Akashik what a match it was full paisa vasool for the mumbai audience because they saw a ton they saw msd hitting those big sixes they saw chennai super kings winning this up and everything happened in this match from jaspreet bumrah's bowling show to pate rana's perfect yorkers from rohit sharma's century to msd's three sixes i have summed it all but i have with me Taus Rizvi has joined us live from the Vankhede Stadium. He'll be telling us what all craziness was present at the Vankhede Stadium. And with that, I also have my colleague Bansal Shah, with whom we'll talk about this clinical win, I would say, of Chennai Super Kings as they have won by a 20 runs. But first up, quickly, Taus, what will happen at the Vankhede? Stadium? Take me through how the public was responding. What all was happening there? It was crazy atmosphere. Crazy atmosphere. People were just like shouting, "CSK and Dhoni." I I didn't feel like I was in Mumbai, right? So I mean, it was and Mumbai fans celebrated Chennai Super Kings victory. I mean, can you imagine? This was one K Day Stadium, and a lot of people were expecting Mumbai to go pass through. Uh, a lot of people wanted. So yeah, can you can you hear me? I hope the network is fine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. We can hear yeah. you. Obviously. So, uh, so fans, fans, fans were out there. Mumbai fans were out there chanting Dhoni, CSK, and they wanted a CSK win and Dhoni win, and that is what they got. Thanks to, uh, of course, uh, the batters, the 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 batting side first. The uh, that uh, who batted first, Chennai Super Kings. They posted a beautiful two hundred and six and. Unthinkable from uh, you know a uh, total that is very very difficult to chase, and the way they restricted them, Patirana, what a bowler he is, yeah, and especially. Well, there are some network issues from uh, Tao's side. Obviously, he's present uh, outside the Vankhede Stadium, and there are jammers. So we all understand, you know, what kind of network issues he must be facing. But Bansal, he pointed out right that you know it was all craziness, and even uh, from our TV sets, we could just hear Dhoni, Dhoni, CSK, CSK out there. But uh, Bansal, let's go back, and uh, yes, we have uh, all our batters from the CSK side, and Tao's is also back. So we'll talk about Chennai Super Kings batting first. Now let me finish this. Let me finish this, Suramya. Suramya, yeah, I mean, uh, yeah, uh, <laughs> Chennai did not get a great start. Ajinkya Rane got out early. I mean, yeah, Rachin Ravindra he started well, but then Captain Ruturaj Gaikwad they expected him to do something. He did it with a beautiful knock. But then the person who stole the show was and people who waited with that bated breath was. Only for Mahendra Singh Dhoni, those three sixes. Can you imagine? I mean, everybody was waiting like last. Oh, when will Dhoni come and take, you know take the guard and start hammering those bowlers? I mean, I feel sorry for Hardik Pandya. He was at the receiving end of Mahendra Singh Dhoni. I don't know what will happen. He will he be discussed now for in, in regards to the T20 World Cup, which is coming up. I mean, whether it's with the bat or with the ball, this man is not having his. I mean, a great outing in IPL, but it was all Mahendra Singh Dhoni. I mean, but who can forget Shivam Dubey? He made a difference. We were talking about uh, the Mumbai bowlers, uh, Mumbai yeah. players. Ajin yeah. Kiran couldn't make a difference, but it was Shivam Dubey and to a certain extent uh, Shardul Thakur. But then it was uh, Mahendra Singh Dhoni with those three sixes. I mean, Ravi Shastri. Can you imagine what a show it was? What a show! Absolutely, it was stunning, Atas, because uh, you know um, everybody waits for MS Dhoni to come out and bat, and especially bat because you know all the twenty overs you see him keeping the wickets. But that batting is something that people really crave for. And today, Mumbai 
Oscars did get not only a glimpse but a full MSD style batting, and those three sixes. I think I think the entire run. social media is going to fill up today with this uh, three sixes of Dhoni that Dhoni scored twenty runs and CSK won by twenty runs. So I think the entire social media is going to get flooded with these memes and these tweets and everything. Well, absolutely, Bansal. You see, at the end of the day, Dhoni's twenty runs were the only difference between um, MI and CSK. So Mumbai Indians, though, they started well, especially Rohit Sharma, and kudos to Rohit Sharma for that hundred. But uh, what a single player can do. nothing you really need some sort of a support from the other end which eventually didn't happen so that was here in the office i was just uh, having a chat with vansal and i was just saying you know uh, the only person can uh, who can take mumbai indians to the victory line is rohit sharma other than that all the other batters will throw their wickets and vansal was you know on the other side he was opposing me he was like no you see there is hardik pandya team david and romeo shefford all the big beasts are there they'll do something but that's what did happen to all of them they were looking so timid in front of csk absolutely it was a huge total but then uh, everybody tried their luck i mean rohit sharma was there at the end again the question returns ki yaar strike rate 156 ka strike rate again that goli uh, debate comes up yaar see that, that is the thing you need uh, see you can be there at the wicket from start to end of course rohit did a great job 63 ball 105 is uh, is quite a decent total but then you need to have that support but that surya kumar yadav uh, you know wicket made a difference yeah. that catch from mustafizur rahman it was because surya has been yeah, in yeah. form he the way he yeah the way he bounced back in this tournament and he was looking good in the last game but then this was i mean destiny uh, had uh, written win all over for chennai super kings because yaar yeah, hardik pandya you you see hardik pandya six ball two uh, two runs uh, tilak verma tried his best 20 ball 31 runs uh romario shefford the last match he you couldn't do it mohammad nabi he is a decent player but he couldn't do it tim david he tried his best he got those sixes but then mustafizur rahman uh, got him so uh, this was chennai super kings day this was chennai super kings match as we predicted as i predicted uh, before the match and uh, yeah <laughs> you were know, there you saw again one yeah. again one more really to your wish list as you added to your wish list as you added to your wish list not predicted <laughs> yeah 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 wish list i wouldn't say prediction because prediction goes wrong wish list comes uh, you know most of the times come true but yeah i, I would say ki dhoni i i would like to go back again dhoni was in some kind of a different mode he wanted to have a go he wanted to uh, you know uh, impress his fans he was there out he was out there just for his fans i but because if you saw he was not a uh, keen on you know uh, even pacing the ball or going for those uh, ground shots which he usually does but then he went out there just threw his bat all around he wanted to slog and he kept on slogging three back to back sixes so was it i mean i don't know what was the intention the intention was purely you know uh, to recollect those memories of 2011 when he got those six uh, in the last ball i mean he wanted to he knew he knows he knows this could be his last season he knows this could be the last time that he will be playing at the 1k day stadium memories uh, return he, he might have got nostalgic and that's why he wanted to finish in that way so that's why he went after hardik pandya three consecutive sixes he could have got fourth but yaar hardik pandya ko bhi credit dena chahiye wo last ball par <laughs> okay <laughs> well i think kitaus has uh, summed it up really really well but you know um, a quick thought that came across my mind was that uh, you know against delhi capitals we saw mahindra singh dhoni in that fiery and fury style okay and i still remember that chennai super kings lost that match but all over the social media there were just and just posts about uh, ms dhoni now today ms dhoni made the difference actually made the difference because he scored 20 runs and csk won by 20 runs and the whole social media is about chennai super kings and mahindra singh dhoni so at the start of our pre match live when we were just discussing about things we were just saying that you know it doesn't matter to fans now whether csk win or they don't win what matters to them is whether they get to see ms dhoni or not and when they get to see ms dhoni in such a beast form i think it's paisa vasool for them but uh, taus was talking 
talking about you know what made a difference bansal he was saying that you know surakumar yadav's wicket of that uh, amazing amazing catch from mustafizur rahman made a difference but i think those six balls that hardik pandya took to make or wasted i think that created the whole difference because even after surakumar yadav's wicket rohit sharma and tilak varma were kind of stitching a partnership but then as soon as tilak varma got out and hardik pandya came in he took too much of time wasted six balls didn't score a single run in six balls and the whole momentum changed um i think it, it would not be fair to blame hardik pandya entirely uh, i think you are right there that he he took six balls and he didn't score runs he just scored two runs in fact but i i don't think that was the sole sole turning point of the match there were quite a few other impact innings and turning points uh, shivam dubey's innings first of all the way he played uh, the way he scored runs at such a brisk rate in we we have been talking about strike rate quite often throughout this tournament and i think the way he played today uh, uh, was was one of the main innings uh, we we can obviously people are going to credit dhoni for his hat trick of sixes and people are going to go bonkers over it but i think shivam dubey was the most impactful innings over there um and apart from that pathirana the way he bowled was amazing amazing stuff uh, i think hardik hardik is taking a bit of too much of pressure i believe or i, I don't know what is wrong with him but uh, uh if he played those six balls he should have made it count but um he couldn't he has not been able to do it in each and every match the last match i think he played he played a few good shots but today he was not able to and got caught in the deep ultimately so yes maybe maybe he should try to score score maybe play a few more ground shots rather than go go through the air but let's see i think there is something definitely wrong with hardik because he was doing things so well for gt but he is not able to do to repeat those things here with the mi mi team like uh, he was coming one down two down with for gt and scoring runs regularly but he is not able to do that here he is coming uh, even if he is coming Uh, in the top four, or if he's coming after after uh, f- fifth or sixth position, and even with the ball, I think he has to change some of some of his strategies. I mean, bowling in the power play or bowling at the death is not suiting him the best um, in this in this team setup, especially when you have other bowlers like Jasprit Bumrah. So I think uh, he has to he has to work on his strategy definitely. Well, yes, he uh, will yeah, really have to work. <clears throat> i believe we yeah, are batting complements bowling so if a batter doesn't uh, do well with the bat it affects bowling as well but then here i would like to make a point i don't know if uh, if it's right or no but my uh, view here is, i mean gt if you remember gt gujarat titans was the responsibility was on hardik pandya right he was batting at number 4 and he was doing it very very well beautifully but then there was no pressure of having big stars with him you know like a rohit sharma or maybe there was surya kumar yadav Here there is too much pressure. Here you are leading a bunch of superstars. There you only had a Subman Gill, who was also a junior to you. So there was no responsibility. There was no pressure of leading the side. There he was enjoying the batting. There he was enjoying the captaincy. Here there is hell lot of pressure right now. Five time champions. You have Rohit Sharma in your top order. You have to adjust them. You have to. Then you have uh, Tilak Varma kind of a batsman who is uh, who is an emerging player. You have a Surya Kumar Yadav. We have a batting heavy, heavy side. When uh, uh, when uh, uh, Hardik Pandya used to bat for uh, Mumbai Indians, there was no pressure. Then he used to enjoy his hitting. There was Kyren Pollard to complement it. There was uh, Krunal Pandya who could uh, you know back him, his brother. So there used to be some kind of uh, gelling. So then he used to play freely. Who perfect finisher ka role ada karte the, role play karte the Mumbai Indians ke liye. But wahan par jaate hi Gujarat Titans ka. उनका रोल कम्प्लीटली चेंज हो गया वहां से वापस आने के बाद अगेन आई एम नॉट एक्सपेक्टिंग हिम टू प्ले एंकर्स रोल आई थिंक ही शुड गो बैक टू प्लेइंग द फिनिशर्स रोल वेयर टिम डेविड इज व्हाट टिम डेविड इज डूइंग मे बी मे बी कम आउट विद समथिंग अ डिफरेंट प्लान एंड दैट इज हाउ व्हाट कुड हेल्प हार्दिक पांड्या द फिनिशर आई वांट टू सी एंड टीम इंडिया वांट्स टू डी वांट्स टू सी हार्दिक पांड्या द फिनिशर नॉट द हार्दिक पांड्या एंकर हु कुड यू नो टेक मोर बॉल्स एंड टू and anchor the innings no i don't want that i want hardik pandya the finisher if he take up takes up the role that role similar role what he used to do he will be a uh, hit again once again hmm 
Perhaps. Uh, well, we have a comment from sports fan. Um, he's saying that in GT there was Nehra in background. Here there is too much pressure on Hardik to implement things. Um, there were no stars. Tal's there were no stars there. Uh, there was no stars there. Here there are superstars. Here there is pressure. So you have to match the superstars. So if you don't match, there is pressure and there is a captaincy. So the Nehra factor is different. There was no pressure. There was no pressure. You enjoyed it. कोई रिस्पॉन्सिबिलिटी नहीं थी कोई आपको ये नहीं था कि यार आपको पीपल विल कम एट यू या आई मीन देर विल बी प्रेशर ऑफ यू नो टू विन द टाइटल देर यू जस्ट वेंट आउट एक्सप्रेस योर सेल्फ यहाँ पर पांच टाइटल जीता और यहाँ पर एक्सपेक्टेशंस बहुत ज्यादा है प्रेशर बहुत ज्यादा है प्रेशर तो ऑब्वियसली है ताउस बट हम उस दिन बात कर रहे थे कि प्रेशर तो फिर हर कैप्टन पर है और हर कैप्टन पर है बड़े बड़े प्लेयर्स को लीड करने का और अपने ऑब्वियसली टाइटल जीतने का भी पर यहाँ पर आप अगर मुंबई इंडियंस को देखिए तो जसप्रीत बुमराह उनके पास एक बहुत बड़े बॉलर है उसके अलावा बॉलिंग में आपको बहुत ही एक्सप्लिसिट कमियां नजर आएंगी आपको हर एक बॉलर में कुछ ना कुछ कमी नजर आएगी और वो दिखता भी है आज जिस तरीके से गायकवाड़ ने बैटिंग करी शिवम दुबे ने batting kari and then you know the way they had let dubey and uh, gaikwar to stitch that partnership and obviously then msd came it was uh, pandya's hard luck to face uh, ms dhoni today on the field but all in all it was a complete failure from mumbai indians especially in the batting side and uh, my heart goes out to rohit sharma because he started off really really well but didn't get any support from any of the batters when he needed it the most well we had a question and uh, Our uh, viewer Mitesh Pandit was saying that Dhoni is looking really good. She should he bat higher? No, absolutely no. Uh, Taus is also saying no. Bansal is also saying no. So I think you've got your answer. And the uh, second one, I'll go to Bansal and ask this one that. Ah, uh, uh, here, here, spin ki baat ho rahi hai, but Shivam Dubey plays spin really, really well. Also, why aren't they opening bowling with Bumrah? वो एक सवाल है वो मैं लेकर जा सकती हूँ बंसल के पास बाकी मुझे लगता है मितेश आपको बाकी दोनों चीजों का जवाब मिल गया होगा बंसल वाई आर एंड ओपनिंग विद बुमरा यार आई डोंट थिंक आई कैन आंसर इट टू द बेस्ट आई थिंक वी हैव टू आस्क दैट थिंग टू हार्दिक पंड्या इट्स इट्स क्वाइट डिफिकल्ट टू to comprehend why is not allowing bumra to open open the bowling i i think he should be bowling at least one or two overs in the power play and then bring him again in the death overs but i don't know what is going through in hardik pandya's mind considering that bumra bumra is such a good bowler and he, he has that ability that he can uh, contain the opposition opening batters at, at, in the start, at the start of the innings itself that will create too much of pressure on the batters when bumra is bowling good at least he will save runs even if he's not getting wickets he, he will make sure that there are the openers are not able to score freely so it's it's really quite difficult to uh, think that why why hardik pandya is constantly not allowing bumra to bowl in the power play or opening the bowling with him um even today i think he bowled he bowled only one over or didn't bowl any overs in the power play i think he bowled one over in the power play and then all all his overs were uh, uh after the power play so it is quite difficult and that was what i was telling earlier that hardik pandya's all these kind of tactics what we saw with gt were going very well even there there were uh, his strategies that were questionable like people were questioning some of some of the decisions he was taking there but then all all, all the cards are falling right there for hardik pandya but the same thing is not happening here so um it's quite quite difficult to understand what is going on and as far as bowling spinners to shivam dubey is concerned i think he is a good player of spin and and to add to it i don't think mi has any very any any strong spinners in their lineup to to bowl to someone like shivam dubey uh, i think the uh, shreyas gopal he, he just bowled one, one over he was not much effective and uh, nabi either was not so effective today uh, so I don't think. Uh, I think Ardik wanted his best bowlers, which are pacers in this in this lineup for him, uh, to bowl against someone like Shivam Dubey. Well, ah, there is never you enough purchase um, for spinners at the Vankhe Day. Taus uh, will yeah, uh, help us knowing that better. But yes, Taus, please Mohammed, continue with your comment. They started with Mohammad Nabi because uh, Rachel Navindra is a left-handed batsman and Mohammad uh, Nabi is an off-spinner. So that is against the spell. They they might have tried that luck or ज़्यादा uh, successful तो नहीं हुआ but then Shreyas Gopal got him but overall देखिए uh, शिवम दुबे की बात आई और बुमराह का I mean I don't know why why they don't they are not starting with that is it making a difference 
आई डोंट नो अगर वो स्टार्ट भी करेंगे तो स्टार्ट अच्छा देंगे मगर बाउंस बैक करेगी दूसरी टीम बाकी बोलर्स भी तो होना चाहिए सो ही डजेंट हैव पार्टनर्स टू यू नो स्टार्ट विथ और टू ब्लॉक इट और टू एंड विथ सो जसप्रीत बुमराह इज दो कम्प्लीटली डिपेंडेड ऑन वाइल शिवम दुबे वाई दिल दे गुड प्लेयर्स इज and they had tried bowling short ball again they had tried bowling short ball against him which was very smart of shivam dubey to tackle it usko pata hai ki yaar agar short ball target kar rahe to mujhe kaise negate karna aur bahut smartly kiya to usne jis touch aur uh, batting wicket bhi thi aur the way he handled the bowlers mumbai bowlers it was still a decent uh, attack and but a better wicket to bat on that's why shivam dubey enjoyed and got a half century which was one of uh, which was instrumental in mumbai's win okay thus we have a question for you sports fan is asking we have seen openers batting till 20th over one was virat kohli who batted first and then uh, in the chase game we saw rohit sharma today what is the solution when opener slows down while playing such long knocks solution i mean the other guys see uh, either see rohit training was still i mean i was just looking at the strike rate 166 is not bad and he's got a 63 105 ball he did not get enough support yeah. so he did not actually slow down because he was he hit five sixes 11 boundaries so he was getting those big shots and and uh, regular at regular intervals not there was no not much gap but uh, slow down mein bahut kam dekhoge aap virat kohli shayad shayad thoda slow down hai the virat this guy has got enough fire power he's got enough shots in his armory that so it becomes easier for rohit to you know uh, Uh, capitalize or overcome those slow start but then there is no solution to it because the only solution is other batters should chip in start hitting those big shots that is the only solution otherwise agar opener slow down ho gaya aur baki log bhi wicket de diya wo bhi slow down ho gaya to team ka diwala nikal jayega bhai koi option nahi aapke paas <laughs> बिल्कुल और ताऊ साहब बात कर रहे थे कि दूसरी तरफ से आपको इतना हेल्प नहीं मिलता है इनफैक्ट इन द गेम अगेंस्ट राजस्थान रॉयल्स वेयर विराट कोहली मेड अ हंड्रेड उस दिन भी विराट कोहली डिन गेट एनी सपोर्ट फ्रॉम दी फॉलोइंग बैटर्स तो आप ऑटोमेटिकली स्लो हो जाते हो क्योंकि आपको एंकर रोल भी करना है आपको फिनिशर भी करना है आपको ओपनर भी सारे रोल्स तो आपके पास आ गए आज रोहित शर्मा के साथ भी वैसा ही हुआ ही गोट ऑल द रोल्स बट देन इवेंचुअली कुछ काम नहीं किया बिकॉज जो बाकी बैटर्स थे उनकी तरफ से रन नहीं आए बट राइट नाउ more than talking about Mumbai Indians let's stick to uh, Chennai Super Kings because they have managed to win this one there were a lot many things to uh, talk about um, MSD's batting a lot to talk about Patirana's bowling a lot to talk about Mustafizur Rahman's catch uh, but uh, there are also two players who batted really well so we really need to uh, talk about them as well one is Gaikwad and the other one is Shivam Dubey both batted really really well Taus ne explain bhi kiya tha ki kaise Shivam Dubey the Mumbai boy batted really fearlessly but हमने स्टार्टिंग से ही ये डिस्कस किया है बंसल चाहे कोई कितना भी अच्छा बैट कर ले चाहे मतीशा पतिराना आज प्लेयर ऑफ द मैच अवार्ड क्यों ना लेके चले गए हो लेकिन चर्चा तो एम एस धोनी का है वो तीन छक्के जो उन्होंने मारे चार बॉल में बीस रन और बीस रन से जीती है चेन्नाई सुपर किंग्स आई थिंक थला फॉर रीजन आई थिंक आई थिंक वी कैन लीव इट टू दैट थिंग थला फॉर अ रीजन आई मीन the people are obviously going to be mad about those three sixes those hat trick of sixes but i was just talking to one of my friends who is a die hard who is a mad mad dhoni fan and, and i was expecting him to go go wild about it but he he was very sensible for a change today and he said that um the shivam dubey's innings was the most important innings if he hadn't played that knock I, the last over heroics of ms dhoni would not have mattered here so um, i think obviously the thing with dhoni this season i feel is coming to bat in the last overs after uh, for when only three or four balls are left so obviously he's not going to try to take ones and two is obviously going to hit the hit the ball hard and try to get as many runs as possible in the uh, in the last three or four balls and also i think he is he has already he already told it last year that he is going to play this season for fans and so is i think he is just trying to enjoy himself he knows it is his last season he knows what the fans want want out of him so i think he's just trying to give that back to fans trying to 
hit those uh, play play just three or four balls but try to hit sixes on each and every ball of this i think we have not seen the helicopter shot so far in this tournament so the fans will be more happier if uh, i'm sorry fans will be happier if if that happens in the coming games and nothing else i mean but i saw one ahead. of the glimpses of uh, uh, dhoni where he was limping you know there was some kind of un- uh, uncomfort Yes, uh, he was looking. He uh, there was discomfort from Dhoni when he was working with the uh, pads on, uh, wicket keeping pads on. So there was a question earlier that uh, whether he should come early. I don't come think early. so. Yeah, yeah. ऐसा नहीं जाना चाहिए धोनी की जहाँ पर low scores हैं यहाँ पर he will come uh, last over. Maybe he will swing the bat and he will get to he will get maximum entertainment if he is there in the last over. Exactly. चाहे वो first over आए या last over entertainment तो आपको मिलेगा. चाहे वो zero पे out हो या team ball में बॉलिंग also what that now lastly we have a comment from harsh thala hai for a reason of pathirana ka andaaz tha katilana oh my god that has summed up the total match where well, thala for a reason there taus is uh, giving a big round of applause to harsh for that comment well thank you so much taus and bhakti for joining me and thanks a lot of viewers and you can watch the cricket next tomorrow we meet you when rcb will face sunrisers hyderabad thank you so much fastest cricket score updates ya sabse detailed stats cricket ke andar bahar ki khabrein ya healthy debates sabse accurate analysis ya fans ka craze sab ke liye ek hi platform kyunki cricket matlab cricket next